basic tutorial on setting up your button manager software. Firstly, let's go to the start menu search window and type in button, then we'll select button manager from the list of software in the, in the pop up at the top. Next we'll see a list of installed scanners on the PC. Please select the model that's connected to your PC and that you intend to use and then click on OK. Next you'll notice the button manager interface pops up on the bottom right of the screen but we want you to find the button manager icon in the system tray, right click and then select profile manager. We can see the standard nine profiles now which are pre-programmed from the factory. Let's select the scan image icon to start with and we'll click on edit to start looking at the features we can adjust. You can see the wide rate of options that we can change such as colour settings, resolution or DPI settings, file formats. For example, let's change a file format to multi-page PDF. Next you can see there's many scan two options. We'll select one by highlighting it and clicking on it. The first one you can see there's a description underneath in the little window. We can also select email for example as a common job. But for an easy setup, let's select Easy Mail and then have a look at the configuration settings by clicking on Configure. In the config window that will pop up next, you can see that we can set the server details and uh, even the local directory lookup so that we can use your preset addresses. Uh, we'll go back to the front and we'll start the Easy Archive section. We'll change back to a multi page PDF again. And at the top, we can adjust the images. In the colour profile, we highly recommend selecting the mixed document type for the best average result. We'll select the image processing tab and we can select an auto rotation of the image which is text based so it's always readable. We'll also select blank page removal and we'll adjust the threshold so we delete the most amount of blank pages. In the more settings section you can actually select how the documents will be separated so you can put a pile of documents on and the software will automatically separate. For now we'll save those settings down by clicking on OK and next we'll show you the scanner interface and on the scanner you can see you can select from 1 to 9 on the keypad if you press the scan button on the scanner that job will automatically commence. Um, we recommend you actually put a list of the scan job buttons on top of the scanner to make it easy to access for future reference.